UCL Doctor is a particular brand of graduate that we feel is a scientifically literate clinician who is safe to practice person-centred medicine and who is also underpinned by the social sciences and thinking about the needs and serving the needs of the general population and the diverse population that we have in the UK but also across the world. The course at UCL Medical School is unique in comparison to other courses given that it is six years in length. That means that all of our students will study for an integrated BSc in the third year of the programme. We have a wide range of BSCs to choose from, from clinical BSCs such as sports and exercise medicine to non-clinical BSCs such as neuroscience or pharmacology. Students who wish to take their research a bit further are able to do an MBPhD as part of the programme. We also feel that being in a central London location is a huge advantage. You will be exposed to a wide range of different people, different patients and different doctors and allied health professionals that you will learn with and from, as well as being at some of the most prestigious hospitals that are tertiary referral centres across the UK. Places like University College London Hospital, the Royal Free Hospital in Hampstead, the Whittington Hospital in Archway, but also places like Moorfields Eye Hospital, Great Ormond Street, and the National Hospital for Neurology and Neurosurgery. In your preclinical years, first and second year, it's pretty nine till five, um, lots of lectures. You've got one big lecture theatre in the Cruciform Building, which is the medical school building. Everyone's in there most of the time. You do sort of CPP, which is clinical and professional practice, where you're in smaller groups in different hospitals and there you might be you know doing your BLS training or practicing breaking bad news um, or just doing sort of more small group activities um, so in third year you intercalate and do a BSc as well as an IBSc so I worked in a lab um, just by UCL which was investigating a gene that's involved in liver disease so then I cut back on lecture time and started spending most of my days in the lab doing like hands-on lab work we're finally onto our clinical years now, where we're applying sort of the theory we learned in the earlier years, and every day is just different. I know it sounds cliche, but you wake up every day and it's that sort of nervous excitement you get, knowing I'm gonna be seeing patients from different backgrounds with different diseases. I'm gonna be speaking with doctors, uh, nurses, other healthcare professionals, which can always be interesting, the sort of dynamic you have in a MDT or in a multidisciplinary team where you're sort of interacting with different patients and it's always a challenge because you have to add that human touch to it because it's, it's very different to the theoretical years. But they also have a very good connection between the medical school and the hospital for getting students involved. So we got to go in and help work in the pandemic. And that was something obviously I didn't think I'd be doing at, you know, 19 or 20, See, tr like treating actual patients um, and actually making an impact we have a wide range of students from a wide range of different backgrounds. Everyone is welcome at UCL. And we want to maintain those values and we are proud of the fact that our student population is diverse in that way. I think what really um, made my mind up for me was once I actually got to visit uh, UCL in the campus and you can just get a feel for the atmosphere here and how supportive really is. All of the year groups, not just in your first week, but throughout time at medical school, the support network here at UCL I thought was something unique and then once I actually got to come to UCL I could see that that was um, just part of everyday life here, it just came naturally. Being in central London is brilliant, you get um, excellent facilities from being a student at UCL and you meet people from such a diverse, um, such diversity and such, so many different backgrounds. And I think that for me is something you might not get when you're maybe just in school or in another university. But being in the heart of London, I think is something which is quite unique. We can only gather us so much information from your application itself. Now we want to meet you and find out more. So tell us your interest in medicine. Tell us about your motivation for studying medicine. Tell us more about what preparation you've made for your application. If you really want to study medicine, it will come across to us. And that's what we want to see.